Some of you are actually running out of spool because you're joining two tables together. And you're saying, I guess I just didn't have enough spool to make it all happen. When in fact, you did have enough spool. But you see, here's the way spool works. If you get 10 gigabytes of spool and your system has 10 amps, they do all space based on a per amp basis. So 10 gigabytes of spool on a 10 amp system, you get one gigabyte per amp. You go over your one gigabyte on any amp, it's going to abort the query and say, you're out of spool. Now, that's a lot of times what's happening in your joins. You're joining two tables on customer number and customer number. Oh, it's order number that's the primary index of this table. Well, we'll just redistribute by customer number and that could be skewed data because one customer may place a million orders, another one, and that's what is happening on some of your joins. The data is skewed and this is causing you to go over your per amp limit of spool. That's why you're running out of spool. Teradata v14.10 join feature PRPD. Partial redistribution, partial duplication. Rows being joined must be on the same AMP, so Teradata will redistribute one or both tables by the join condition if the rows are not naturally on the same AMP. If a table is being redistributed by the join column and that column causes skew, the query might abort with a spool error because all spool space is calculated on a per amp basis. Partial redistribution, partial duplication, PRPD, is a new hybrid join strategy for joins that have equality join conditions in the case where one or both of the joining tables are skewed. It provides a divide and conquer approach to reduce the impact of data skew on query and system hot amp situations. PRPD divides the two sources into subsets based on skewed values extracted from statistics histograms. It performs several two or three regular joins between those subsets and combines the join results of the subsets into a common spool. It's a two-fold plan. If only one source is skewed, both sources are divided or split into two subsets and two regular joins are performed. The three-fold plan will be if both sources are skewed on different values, both of them are divided or split into three subsets and three regular joins are performed. Once again, Teradata is finding ways to bring value to customers in an area that can have enormous impact. The joining of two tables when data is skewed. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Serving the data warehousing needs of the world for 20 years. Check out coughingdw.com for more information.